Hello and welcome to the Stephen Tries Podcast, Series 3, Episode 10. Whoa! <laughs> Jesus oh. Christ. Oh, sorry. Jesus Christ, man. you two. It's the energy, isn't it? Great Very goons. Do you know people, uh, people in gangs get called goons? I wouldn't want to be called a goon. No. I'd be furious. Oh, you got no. so, you got some goons, like 50 Cent has goons. I don't yeah. want that. Maybe that's to uh, keep the morale low so that they're angry. Yeah. Uh, this week I'm joined by <laughs> my own goon, Joe McGraw. Hello, everyone. Uh, glad, glad to be back. Amongst friends. Yeah. Colleagues. Don't like you, Lovers yeah. once. Uh, I'm also joined by Tom Looney. Looney! Looney! Thanks for having me. Looney. Joe! Joe! Come on! Sorry, he's he's making man. it weird. Turning yeah. into the Joe show now. Oh, yeah. You know, when am I going to be involved? <laughs> and Max Smith. Hey! Hello there! <laughs> <laughs> this is episode 99 Ooh. of all the podcasts, really? including the first four we did on uh, the main channel. Yeah. Fuck me. Back in the days. Take that. Yeah. Next week we'll do a, a special. Look out for that. Yeah. It's probably already uh, already been filmed, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. Stupid. No, we're all going to do it in here. Ooh, a bit of a weird assumption, Joe, that <laughs> you'll be involved. Oh, could out the last 10 minutes, going to. You could, but you'd probably forget. Stumble over all the mics. <laughs> <laughs> well, the last 100 seconds yeah could be dedicated to me really dedicate my I don't no. think you deserve it I'll be right. honest you just seconds of dedication when I think of uh, could be an in memoriam as he dies as yeah. he trips over yeah that would be good okay yeah. there you go you still got a section dedicated to you oh, thank you yeah. a big section in memoriam Joe got married to put it. <laughs> no I didn't get married I got you engaged you did that what <sighs> read that Joe I got engaged well done well done Yay. Joe thank you everyone who wants to come to the wedding didn't get invited. So busy. Uh, the, the wedding's not happened yet. Big engagement sure. party on Sunday. Yeah. Didn't give you us all an address. Got invited. Where was it? Where was oh, it? Yeah. Joe? What time was it? You were all saying I couldn't make it. You no, said yeah, to I keep it free. Mother's Day. You said you to keep give it us an free. address. You mentioned it like in passing, like very briefly, but never invited me or said. Gave us a oh, where to go. Monday. Right, I'll speak to you in a bit. Right, we're going to do Sunday. another one at the end of Sunday, the month. Another one. Why? Because some people couldn't make it. We weren't. Was we weren't the you three couldn't make it. You said you keep I Sunday said free. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I called my mum and said I'm not making it no, to your you party. Didn't. No, you didn't. Joe's got something really important no, for me. Text me on Sunday saying, "Oh, sorry, where's the address for this thing?" I, I'm not going to go on my way to do that. Oh. You're meant to message us for the address. Look behind you. Lovely. Got shit to do. It's not how you invite people, mate. How would you invite people? I'd say, oh, I'm doing this. You're, oh, you're, you're invited. Oh. Here's the address. Here's the time. Didn't get uh, invited to Tom's engagement party either. No, to be fair. Didn't really have one. Can sure. He's talking, on talking into his it. hand. For yeah. listeners at home, he's I talking mean, into like, his hand. I did go for a drink with my, my family and uh, Devon's family. Wow. What are we, like, what are we Max? Are we, yeah? yeah, are we not a family? Like, found family? Yeah. Well, feel free to all come to the wedding. Don't know what it is. Really yeah. Feel free. I'll take you a proper <laughs> invite. That's a really cute. Oh. A couple of years we we'll get a plus one. I don't think we're invited based on yeah. the fact that we started a rumor that you have you wait. Shag dogs. That was a rumor. Oh, Ooh. I never said that. <laughs> yeah, it was Sorry. Rumor, the, it? Sorry. the video was convincing. I thought, I, I thought we exposed him and we felt bad about that. <laughs> have I told the fact on here that to stop a dog from eating your dog, you put your finger up his bum? That's your thumb. That's a fact. You could do whatever index or whatever. Yeah. No, I just, <laughs> that way in the dog part learn, with the strap was, on. Any long appendage. <laughs> I was trying to learn a bit of dog uh, first aid yeah. on the internet just in case book ever goes down. Oh. And this guy had a. Oh my God. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> Fingers crossed. <laughs> and this guy had a. <laughs> and this guy had a fact that if, like, say a dog, a really vicious dog, like, graps onto your dog and, like, is swinging it about, big one. Yeah. The only thing you can do, the element of surprise, is stick your finger up his bum. And right. his Does that work with muggers as well? <laughs> it could do, unless they like it. Good to practice. <laughs> uh, anyway, tell us about your engagement. <laughs> Went to Cleethorpe's Beach, a beach called Fitties. <laughs> nice. Fitties? Yeah. Not suitable. Why are you winking at me? Fitties. Uh, uh, fitties. Fitties, like a yeah, yeah. pair of fitties yeah, on the beach. You drink some hooters afterwards. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I bought fish and chips. You're bad. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. <laughs> We're the one who gets the tits out, not you. <laughs> I, uh, I had the top on the whole thing. Anything else? See him, mate. Yeah, uh, <laughs> if it was gone. Went to Fitties Beach, bought fish and chips, yeah. a little blanket. Put the blanket down, fish and chips down, and then before we ate, I just said, will you marry me? I had a little speech prepared, but it all just disappeared from my head. Yeah. So then I just went down on one knee and said it. Would you like to do your speech now? Yeah. Love you, Becky. Uh, no, I'm not going to do my speech now. Was, okay, well, I mean, it's quite, quite a big thing. It's it just, just a Just asking. Minutes. Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. Not because chips are going to go cold. The thing is, the beach is quite busy. Fitty's yeah. beach is busy. 
Friday night. Is it? Yeah. Friday. Yeah. I would have had the chips first. Yeah, man. Yeah. Would you? Did you have your fish It was and a chips? thing that I was toying with in my head is the order. Yeah, have the fish and chips. It's, it's, it's when you're in the car and you've got the takeaway and you can smell it, you want to have it there. That's and then true. Don't want to listen to What if you're too full, though? But then, but then I wouldn't have enjoyed the fish and chips knowing that at the end of the fish and chips, yeah. I've got to pop That's the question. That's terrible. <laughs> <laughs> did, you, uh, did you hide the ring in the gravy? No, we had curry Gravy? Fish gravy. and chips? That's like a yeah. northern thing, isn't it? Oh, Not on fish. I was going to hide the ring in the dog. Fishy gravy. gravy. Yeah, you were going to hide the ring in the dog. In the dog's collar. <laughs> you said you'll hide the ring in the dog, Joe. <laughs> right, sing no, your thing. No, you're no, no, his no, bum no. and he'll pull out with a ring on. <laughs> I, I, I remember you speaking to me saying you're worried something will go wrong with it, but then your plan was to give give your dog the ring at the at the beach. And I said, does your dog like the sea? And he went, yeah. oh yeah, he does like the sea, actually. <laughs> he would have just run in the Already sea. on the beach. He yeah, did run in with it. it. What you do is when you buy an engagement ring, you always buy a bit bigger. I brought a little ring in the register and went, what we'll do is we'll go one size up just in case anything's happened. Sure. Christmas has been. So we, I bought it and I put it on and it was good, but it was just, just, it was just a little bit too loose. Loose. Oh, at well. the end of the meal, How fish and chips. <laughs> fish and chips was lovely, by the way. Sea Lanes Fisheries. If you had to give up, if you had to give up your fiance or fish and chips, what would it be? Uh, fish and chips, because wow, likes, that's beautiful. She likes the podcast. Yeah. Uh, clap, could clap it. Uh, we're getting she, ready. She likes leave. this. I think so. Yeah. She's something like, wrong with I mean, it. She no, no. Seem nervous. She <laughs> likes Max a lot. Watching Max. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That, that funny. One of the only people. The, the other, the other funny ones as well. <laughs> yeah. the, the ones with the the fades. <laughs> Yours is on the top, though. I know. It's going. It's going. Yeah. Uh, yeah. My, turkey, my, turkey barbers keep trying to, my turkey barbers keep trying to send me to Istanbul. A couple of grand each. So. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What for? Make a holiday of it. For a hair transplant. Right. Really good shisha out there. Yeah. <laughs> Every kebabs. time you come, it makes me sad. <laughs> it is. So, uh, well, they're doing half a job, eh? <laughs> Uh, they just want to repeat custom, don't they? Yeah, yeah. And I guess you know every haircut could be my last. You, you think you get us in a celebrity discount? Yeah. <laughs> half price because you got half there. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I went on with it a bit there, guys. Joe, what? tell us what went wrong. Uh, when we were packing up, she just uh, uh, the ring just flew off the finger. Get the bags. Get this thing off me. <laughs> I'm your carer, Joe. <laughs> Do you know what, it really? The sand really ruined the fish and chips. It was yeah. just sandy fish and chips. Yeah. Do you know what, the whole thing was a bit? It just went. It just went wrong. I didn't think about kept. it enough. <laughs> <laughs> I to ask. Call this kit on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, it just went wrong, right? And mm. I should have done it on a beach. The f- ring slips off a finger, it lands in the sand, and there's a little 10 seconds of stamping about going, we've lost it. <laughs> stamping? That's 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 yeah, and then you know they'll be stamping yeah, about. No, like, I don't know, my father's like, "What do you mean you lost it?" You like, like, one job, one <laughs> job. <laughs> yeah, the dog runs about because he's just running about. Yeah, yeah. And then they stop. And everyone stops like that. Stop. Everyone. And they, yeah, it was just me and Becky. The whole beach. Is this an advert for your dog training? <laughs> yeah, I am an excellent dog trainer, but I don't do private sessions. <laughs> you do with your. You're not allowed to anymore. <laughs> <laughs> There's always got to be an observer. Why are they all wearing studded yeah, collars? <laughs> <laughs> Even the trainer. <laughs> <laughs> and nothing else <laughs> why did you pick a beach why did you she pick likes, fitties she likes the beach yeah she likes yeah. fitties beach right okay I thought that would be nice wouldn't it that's beautiful yeah. uh, and then we lost the ring and it went really far in the sand and we couldn't find it for two and a half hours <laughs> uh, until we found a metal detector online metal detector guy called Mark so if I shout out Mark do you know what? you you were actually on BBC News weren't you Northwest yeah. tonight talking about yeah. it wow and they tried to get Mark on, but... Oh, do you want to see a clip? Because I've got... <laughs> oh, jeez. I recorded a clip of this. What have you done here? <laughs> it's a clip of it. The sound isn't great. <laughs> I just I just picked the best minute. Joe McGrath from Stockport went to buy an engagement ring so he could propose to his girlfriend, Becky. He had it all planned out, a trip to Cleethorpes, down on one knee on the beach. So far, so good. So, Joe, what went wrong? Well, I pooed myself, didn't I? I got on the beach at Cleethorpe, smell of sea salt, spooked me. Big log in me trousers before you know it. Oh dear, splattered all over me flip-flops. Heaven forbid. I'd gone there to walk the dog, sorry, wank the dog, and and, and chaos ensued. Thankfully, a bloke called Mark turned up. 
we, we Mark, we were hoping to speak to him. I think he's up in Hull, isn't he? But yeah. So he t- he's not he's not there, but he he turned up with his. What I mean, has he got a job? Oh, talk about a fat dong. I was looking at this mighty meaty, thinking it'll take ages to make him climax. He took twenty minutes to get there, by the way. Didn't ask. My dog didn't know what was going on. Uh, my dog's very confused, by the way, because normally he's... The one chewing a bone. He's like, why are we just spending three hours... Noshing off a bloke called Mark? And I got on my knees and I said, thank you. If you know what I mean. And by that, I mean I sucked his cock dry. She said no, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> there we have it, Jack. <sighs> wow. Bad, bad language for 6.30 on her. Yeah, that. Yeah. It wasn't me, mate. Com complaints come in, but... You're used to them. <laughs> <laughs> well, we had one. Yeah, well done. Wow, that's incredible, man. Yeah. So brave to go on, uh, on the news and say that as well. Yeah, we found it. Yeah, it's strange Mark didn't show his face. <laughs> <laughs> Joe, that reminds me, actually. Uh, you, you went on live TV... And didn't plug the podcast. I know. Oh! oh. Is there was, anything redeemable about you? Because there was no opportunity to. Of course there, there is. is. You mad. manipulate an opportunity. It's 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 please, it. please watch that interview and you'll hear him going on about the dog for 20 minutes. The dog were confused because usually, no, you know, when it's Sandy, it's, it's, it's cold, but it was warm. As soon as he said Joe from Stockport, you should have said, and also the Stephen Tries podcast. Yeah, well, yeah. someone doesn't even like me on this. Someone said one of the complaints is that I only should come on on special occasions. Absolutely. You don't deserve yeah. a shout out. Oh, you do. Of course, well, yeah. Kind of, yeah come they're on, they're man. kind of vindicated now. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. You've, like, uh, we'll do. We'll do a vote here. Who thinks Joe should be punished? Oh no! I don't know. Oh yeah. There yeah, you go. I mean, so it's, now it's, everyone it's, on the it's, podcast it's, is going to be punished. I tell you what. Us, you know. Either you get punished, or you try and get back on the BBC News and shout out the podcast. You have twenty-four hours. Yeah. I'll get punished. <laughs> I'll take it. Okay. Okay. Yeah. The punishments will be random. I've got yeah. seven punishments oh. written down. Oh God. No. Well, they vary. <laughs> oh, we're we're all in it? the same boat, and if you don't do it, I say you donate to charity. How much? <laughs> See what the group thinks. Yeah. It's going to be my punishment, isn't it? Two hundred money to charity. Two hundred quid. There we go. Well oh, done, Joe. God. Anyway, Max, what have you been doing? Great question, Stephen. Um, I is went. It? It's quite an average question. It's a killer of a question. <laughs> <laughs> it fucking is, man. Went to A and E the other night. Oh no. Uh, fuck me. You get there. Yeah? <laughs> First thing we see, a woman's just thrown up on on the floor. Yeah, why were we there? Your pud- uh, my girlfriend had a bad reaction to tablets. Okay. <sighs> why don't you mind your own business, Tom? <sighs> sorry, sorry. sorry. She's sorry. fine now. Sorry, sorry. Thanks for asking. Story. Right. Um, a lot of sick on the floor. Gets cleaned up like that. NHS, well done. We're there for f- like 14 hours. 14? 14. Yeah. That's a lie. Get there at 8 in the evening yeah. and leave the next day at like 11, 12. Ah, furious! Insane. How many times did that woman throw up? Only the once. Uh-huh. I got her kicked out. Did you have food or anything in there? You asked the right questions, Joe. Uh, what food do you have? <laughs> do chili con carne Saturday night, don't they? This is going to keep you going. Do you Doesn't get the bread roll? Apparently, they've got a good menu these days in the hospital. Do they do yeah. wings? <laughs> Slices do of wings lasagna. Yes. No, not sadly wings not for no. the NHS. <laughs> Clapping wings together at eight pm on a Thursday. <laughs> My mate was in uh, overnight the other week. Said so he never ate so well. What are you talking about? Hospital food. He was in there for anorexia, though. <laughs> <laughs> you never, what did he have? <laughs> Why are we going into his mate? You can see his life. mate makes a statement like he's never eaten so well. Did he have oh, a he's, he's broken arm, what? Did he have a pudding? Did he have a pudding? Yeah, he will have had a pudding. Oh, John, yes, you're not going to injure yourself. Bring me out. <laughs> they say the th- uh, you know, the, it's about the uh, breaking a thumb is as easy as snapping a carrot. Yeah, you talk shit. No, it, it is. is, yeah. It is, but like... When have you ever snapped your thumb? It's, no, it's, oh, I mean, how easy would it be to break someone's finger? But you wouldn't... We can't break our own finger unless you're like, got a screw loose. I don't know, mate. The body's just it. bits, isn't it? it? I mean, what, how strong do you think a finger is? Stronger than a carrot. That's your mum. <laughs> no, that was, that was the joke. I, I didn't want to no, say no, that No, 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 no. My mum watches as well. Yeah. I've met Tom's mum. Yeah. Does she like a carrot? <laughs> why, uh, why, are you, why are you saying it like that? Oh, sorry, sorry. Carry on. In other news, I got a mini Tesla from Will and E. Hey. Giving it, don't clap, please. Where is it? For I gave it to my nephew. Oh, that's nice. He didn't want to drive in it. I asked, can I? He said, no. <laughs> What's the point? Niece still cries every time she looks at my face. Just, oh. went, you know, just like all the other women. Um, so I've got, yeah. I got a mini Tesla. Uh, other people... That have done far less for Will, got a Rolex what? and really fancy oh, Pokemon man. card. Each shit, Will. Yeah. You got a Tesla? Mini Tesla. Yeah. Could you, so small. For children, yeah. Yeah, it's for children. Yeah, it's I, for can't, children. I can't sit there. I've got a fat ass. No. Good marks. 
Oh, if he can't, I how would I? But Max, Max just glided in, yeah. He drove <laughs> off in it. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I'm so annoyed. Yeah, huh? Deceptive, aren't you? Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, man. Uh, I'm well, top heavy, all right? My legs are so slim. <laughs> Yeah, it wasn't. <laughs> I was right next to the camera. <laughs> <laughs> a Top Gear parody, Top Heavy, that could be good. Hey! A gaggle in the car! <laughs> Are you <all> right <laughs> <on that>? <laughs> <laughs> well, well, A convertible, finally! <laughs> 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 we take the passenger seat out. <laughs> That's a dream, eh? Yeah, yeah. But I, I gave him. I didn't give him my real Stormzy jacket because I knew. Yeah, uh, he told me about a mystery prize, and I, yeah, I knew it was going to be uh, a something off. shit. So he's framed a, a jacket from Depot. Do you know what the worst thing is? That that mini Tesla was uh, sort of paraded as the best gift. Really? Yeah, but he actually sold his real Tesla, which I should have won. You said for a few weeks I was actually going to win a real Tesla, so thank you for those few well, weeks in your head. You wouldn't say that, would you, if you were going to give a prize? You're going to give someone a really good prize, and they went, actually, I was going to give you this really good prize. Yeah. And I don't care. Anyone, you couldn't even fit in. Don't care, mate. Uh, it's now time for some complaints. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So we're we're me, I've been here for a while. Tom, I have one for you, oh, I'm afraid. Uh, nice. Last week, Max was speaking about eating snails. You didn't make a joke about a slug eating snails. Oh, no! <laughs> Why would you? <laughs> Why would you? Oh. A bit rude. I can't it? believe Who's it. on a plate for you? <laughs> oh, <laughs> hey. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Don't, don't I get that. <laughs> uh, time for these complaints. This one is from Ben. He says, I'm going to read it to you, Joe. I don't like looking at Ryan's head. It makes me feel on edge and nervy every time the camera cuts to him. I just have to wait until the camera's back off him. No offence, Ryan. You are funny. It's almost become an ick. <laughs> Oh, so we can't look at Ryan's face. <laughs> uh, oh, that's, that's awful. That is awful. <laughs> that's, that's just, that's just a straight up insult. He doesn't, he doesn't even like <laughs> say anything in <laughs> uh, Next complaint. I don't, I don't have anything other than uh, great complaints here, Joe. Okay. Uh, hello Stephen, Max, Tom and probably Ryan I have many complaints about the podcast that you bring every week However there is one Mr Cameron Green needs to be the first name on the team sheet for that, for that podcast Week in, week out You've got yourself Well actually we have got the week out Yeah, that's why Cameron's not here Hey, no, I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking You got yourselves a Luis Diaz there And you're playing a Minamino in Ryan And a Harvey Elliott in Dave every week Now I'm sure Dave is a lovely lad And don't get me wrong, he does add something in there But Ryan on the other hand <laughs> That tone deaf mongrel has a face for radio and a voice for silent movies. I'm not saying, I'm not saying he should be sacked. But ask him to speak more. He sits in the chair silent. Sometimes I forget when I listen to it, sometimes I forget my voice. A face for radio and a voice for silent movies. That's the, oh, that's incredible. Oh, God. Uh, next one. <laughs> <laughs> face is an idiot. Ryan. Ryan's getting it today. Hello, Stephen. Straight to the point here. Fucking get rid of IMAX immediately. Oh, <laughs> also, more of Cam Green. Hey, listen, yeah, that's fair. That's fair. That's bad. No, that's, 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 that's a bit weird. It's a bit wild. Blast very week. strange. This is genuinely how it goes. Next email. My complaint is there isn't enough IMAX, and I think Tom Looney should be shortened down or even removed yes! from the podcast, so, yes! I'm, so IMAX can extend. <laughs> yeah. To be fair, you're you're I you're fucking you sense the irony with that one. The That's issue like, is, it's, it's, like, it's like people. You are you are you are <laughs> filling up valuable uh, real estate on the podcast where I could move in. Yeah, that's great. Yeah, I, I don't see it. Five minute IMAX next week. You resent that five minutes. <laughs> you know, you know, five minute IMAX. You're the Bucky McBuckface of this podcast. <laughs> Uh, do you want one more? Yeah. Yes, please. <laughs> IMAX is so dreadful. No, not that one. <laughs> I want more. I want another one. I want another one, please. <laughs> this shit sandwich, except this shit. <laughs> yeah, it's like your hair came out. They, tumble recently. They say they say IMAX is good. <laughs> Thank you. Can, for I can get up and take a piss whilst it's playing. <laughs> <laughs> That doesn't make any sense. He's yeah. probably, probably, probably listening with headphones. He doesn't have to like, pause anything or do anything. Yeah, because yeah, yeah, he's yeah. got wearing his headphones so he can go out. Oh, if he's in headphones, then he's fucked, doesn't he? Let's <laughs> take him out. No, nah, not at all, mate. Not at all. Nah, not uh, this. Great segment. <laughs> it's now time for a bloody good segment. Oi, did you hear what that loony bloke just said? That's right. It's Tom <laughs> Looney's celebrity gossip. Will Smith slapped Chris Rock at the Oscars. Yeah, yeah, that's fair. Oi, did you hear what that loony bloke just said? Hey, we'll have, we'll have a, an ad read, shall we? Uh, this week, it's our sponsor again. Pretty much our only sponsor recently. That's Noom. 
Noom, noom, noom. Looking for a good noom. Hey guys, let's just cut to the chase. Lose the weight for good. Sign up for your trial at noom.com slash Stephen. S-T-E-P-H-E-N. That's noom.com slash Stephen. Joe, I turn to you because a lot of people, when it comes to the wedding days, go, I'm going to get in great shape. Is that has that crossed your mind at all? I might get bigger. <laughs> yeah. I don't need Noom. I'm going to fit in that suit if it kills me. <laughs> <laughs> my, my granddad's suit. <laughs> Just one of those sumo suits you meant to blow up. <laughs> it's a Siamese twin. <laughs> uh, I'll try and lose a bit of weight. I won't kill myself doing it. No? No. Thanks to Noom. Yes. <laughs> Noom can help you with that, Joe, because they yeah. have a psychology-based approach. Wow, they're gonna get in my head. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. I don't think that's how, I don't think that's their slogan. We're gonna get in your head. <laughs> no, you're playing them I'm a poker. Manipulate you into losing weight. <laughs> <laughs> Instead of setting strict set of rules, Noom empowers you with the knowledge and psychology to build smarter, more sustainable habits and behaviours using a cognitive behavioural approach. Learn about that in uh, psychology. Did you ever do it? No. No. You'll focus on the why instead of the what to change your relationship with eating. How is your relationship with eating? Oh, I eat a lot. Yeah. If anything, I think about it a lot as well. Ooh, breakfast. What am I going to have? Yeah. Pudding. Well, I'm, should, should I be saying to myself, oh, why am I going to have breakfast? Are you, are you one of those people who, uh, where they use that phrase, uh, I don't eat to live, I live to eat. Indeed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Well, why do we live to eat? Is that what they're saying? Well, with Noom, I'm sure you can find a diet that caters to your winged needs. Mm-hmm. Yes, please. Wow. Is, is Noom the... Was he the uh, the guy from the Teletubbies? You know, the, the uh, Noom, 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 Noom. They do not associate with Noom, Noom or the Teletubbies because <laughs> Tubby that. Custard is really bad for the diet. Yeah, man. <laughs> they can't work around it. More than 80% of users complete the programme, not Teletubbies. Uh, more than 60% of users lose 5% or more body weight and 60% of them keep the weight off for a year or more. So that's, yeah, that's taking you through to the honeymoon, Joe. Wow, that's 2023, mm-hmm. minimum. And you can have honey. Noom has published over 25 peer-reviewed scientific journal articles about the science that goes into their approach to helping people achieve a healthier way of life. Nice? Yeah, I'm up to it so far, I fancy it. Yeah. Well, if you want it, Joe, lose the weight for good, sign up for your trial at noom.com slash Stephen. That's noom.com slash Stephen. Thank you, Noom. Noom me, Noom you. <laughs> Ah, there you go. Yeah. Nice. Noom, 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 noom. I watch it in my room. Oh, why'd you have to ruin it? Ooh, weird that. Look, you right in the eyes as well. Oh, yeah. Time for some news. 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 Not good news. Not good news to begin with. Uh, Foo Fighters drummer Taylor Hawkins <laughs> died. <sighs> and on top of that, uh, today as we recorded, Tom from the Wanted's dead. Awful business. Yeah. Oh, death. Poor guy. Death is never good. No. I was more of a wanted fan than Foo Fighters, but Joe, I know you're big into music. Big into the Foo Fighters, saw them a couple of years ago. We had tickets to see them in June, and obviously they've postponed, cancelled all their gigs now. They are coming yeah. to the Old Trafford Cookie Ground, going to go see them, but you know, you got you got to cancel it, because yeah, well, quite yeah. big fans, Dave and... Yeah. No, big friends, not fans. Dave and... Uh, uh, what's yeah. Obviously, Foo is nearly food. Yeah. Yeah. It's not yeah, far off, isn't it? No. Yeah, well, it's not the <laughs> eulogy we need. Food fights are a waste of food, anyway. Why do you want to throw food? Yeah. Stick in your gob. Food That's fights, fair. yeah. Don't look at me like that, Show Joe. I feel, I feel like I've done something wrong in a food fight. <laughs> not had a food fight. Never. Uh, Favourite Foo Fighters song? Uh, times like these. Yeah. Sure. Monkey Wrench. Yeah. Favourite The Wanted song? I'll turn to Tom. Uh, I'll get this wrong. like Rihanna, sure. We'll <laughs> yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. We all enjoy that one. Yeah. Max, for a while, that was my dad's only song on his <laughs> Apple Music library. And he, and he did walk. He did walk like Rihanna. Yeah. He, did, he turned does. heads. Yeah. Glad you came. I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> that's mine. That's no. my favorite song. <laughs> okay. Yo, 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 they wanna know. Quote from. Yo, yo. Leonardo DiCaprio is so passionate about climate change because he wants to leave a better world for his girlfriend. Not like Ricky Gervais. Okay. Oh no 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 no! It's, that's ju- that's a, that joke's been done before, and I'm going to go Amy Schumer for that. I'm oh, still Ricky Gervais. I'll go for Bill Maher. <laughs> <laughs> it's Amy Schumer. Oh. Oh. She uh, apparently stole this joke off Twitter. Yeah, she. There's, that's all she does. Isn't the it? joke she was years ago. So many, so many times. Yeah. There's compilations of it. It's yeah. disgusting. Joke thievery. I was speaking about this uh, the other day. It it irks me so much. 
I saw my Will Smith jokes getting robbed. Yeah. yeah. I saw that as well. I yeah. saw that a lot, actually. Really? Yeah. We need to uh, get them all for the uh, punishments. I don't think they'll be into that. <laughs> get Amy Schumer in. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> he got a bullet in the head. <laughs> Seems hard. You see that will donate £200 to charity. <laughs> <laughs> kill me. Kill me now. <laughs> yeah, she did, she did that. And then there was a... There was a joke she did at the Oscars, or wherever it was, where she moved someone out of the seat or called them a seat. Yeah, yeah. Not a funny joke anyway, but uh, Neil Patrick Harris had done it. <sighs> Fuck. Stop yeah. reading that. Yeah. Naughty I'm amazed she has a career, like, because this is like... She doesn't really it's, it's a meme, isn't it, about her, you know, stealing jokes. Yeah, yeah, like yeah. Open, it's so it's so a, People just like... Yeah. A few years ago, the most paid at, uh, comedian on the circuit doing, like, uh, in America... I said, don't tell people. <laughs> was that... Is it Jeff Dunham? You know, the guy that does the racist... Uh, oh, he's got the... The puppet. The puppet. He's got the uh, Bin Laden puppet. Yeah. In America, he was the comedian that made the most money for, like, a set amount of years in a row. God. Because his tours are, in like, so packed. Yeah. It's not funny. It's, like, Republican sort of weirdos that go to it. You can either be funny or you can just say things that people have heard that are funny. Yeah. yeah. That happens so much, especially on the internet. Mm. People just say other jokes that you've seen tweeted yeah. 10 hours earlier. Yeah. All right, uh, Max, it's time for your laugh, you lose. Yeah. You yeah. are trying to make us laugh. <laughs> okay, Jeff. Trying and hopefully succeeding. He's reaching <laughs> for his pocket. Uh, when, when would you like to start? Can you just count me down from, give me okay. a hefty five? Three, two... One. Yippee! I love the Stephen Tires podcast. You know, back when I'm at home, I always do it myself. This is my little potato, Max. Hello, Max. How are you feeling today? I'm feeling fucking juicy, mate. Hey, it's Tom here. Yes, Tom's here. Hello! My name's Tom, and I've got a stinky haircut. Don't say that, Tom. You should love yourself and be happy with yourself. Anyway, let's have a great day and a great podcast. Yippee! <laughs> do, 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 do. And it really I was first. The, the bit that made me laugh was the thought of you selling that onto a pencil. <laughs> that could see me. It's been fucking ages, that. Yeah. So it's, it's me next week. Yeah. Oh. Do with you. And if no. you want to be entered into a free prize draw to win these, <laughs> what, are you, what are you doing, man? Oh, fine, fine. Okay. Do you want to do it, Joe? See you off that. Um, Oh, good. Really? Good dude. Really? I don't think that's funny. Yeah. Oh, well, I'll probably laugh. Did you not no, just I'll watch that? Go, I'll give it a go. 30 seconds up to make me laugh. Yeah. Are you ready? Use it. No. Not right now. <laughs> I've had too um, much comedy, eh? Fucking hell, that was ridiculous. <laughs> that was a bit. <laughs> I'm surprised that these uh, staples went in the potato, to be fair. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, no. Yeah, no, you're not in that. <laughs> Just Max making them out. <laughs> Just chuckling to himself. There's no chuckles, no chuckles. Anyway, it's now time for the talking points. Yay! Uh, and this week, we're going to talk to Joe for a bit. Oh, God. Uh, Joe, you've been doing stuff with the BBC. What was that? Uh, I've been going out and about in what they call the BBC Mobile. <laughs> to, uh... But they called it in the 80s when they picked up kids. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Come at the back of the BBC mobile. And I've been going. <laughs> Shh, to, don't tell. <laughs> I've been going to different uh, places wherever they send me. Like today, I was learning about gardening. Anyway, listen, it's all like. Why are you coming over this way? Piss you off. You like gardening? <laughs> house plants. All about how to grow your house plants better. I spoke to a yeah. guy called Paul. Yeah. He was Did head you, of plants. The Daisy Nook. You could uh, you could dig up in yeah. the soil and look for the secrets from the BBC in the eighties. Yeah. <laughs> oh great! <laughs> look we Yeah. Yeah. Um, I went I to a bakery three. last yeah. week in Chorlton. I can tell. What did you bake? A nice little sourdough. Delicious. Oh, is that what that was? Delicious. You posted a picture, I wasn't sure. It was It was lovely. Nice bit of butter on there, Tom. You'd yeah. have loved it. He, like lo- he loves his butter. butter. Like, uh, yeah. He loves butter. his butter. Grounds himself oh, and stuff. Good but, uh, for the BBC. Yeah. 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 Well, Did you go out on the radio? Yeah, yeah only on the radio. That's good, only. yeah. On good the radio? Butter. I like listening to butter yeah. melt on a sourdough. <laughs> <laughs> you put the mix in the mix and boom, 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 yeah. and then you get it out boom, 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 and then you chop it up put it in the prover that doesn't make any noise yeah, I guess you can't really justify the licence fee anymore can you? <laughs> no. BBC what? Radio Manchester ah. Radio Manchester is anybody listening anymore? yeah I don't know well, no one's ever come up to me and gone are you the guy from Radio Manchester? well they don't really radio's a bit different isn't it to like TV and stuff yeah they can't see anything what, yeah. what do they say when, when people recognise you what is it? they just say you're the guy who eats kebabs yeah they say yeah 
course, you could probably guess. Yeah. Oh, oh that's not fair. It's, it's horrible, bad. that. Don't sell oh, people just come to me. Do you want a healthy potato? A lot of people will say uh, from this is either, how's your dog, or is the mic on? <laughs> <laughs> valid questions. Two yeah. valid questions. The, welfare, boss of the, man the welfare of your dog. At which point you panic yeah, and run yeah, off. Yeah, yeah. I've got to say, the dog's fine. The dog's yeah. fine. Like on St. Patrick's Day, these guys came around me and just said, oh, how's the dog? And I said, well, the dog's fine. And then I showed her a picture of it. Bill Rennie's break. <coughs> yeah, we stopped making that a segment, you know. <laughs> what? <laughs> Rennie's so pulled out. Money, <laughs> <laughs> they pulled out at the brief stage. <laughs> Ever pulled out at the brief stage? Uh, Sexy. You have to, don't you, sometimes? Why? You want to keep it in, do you? Have you... Have you uh, have you came whilst undressing? No, I've never <laughs> came whilst undressing. Oh, oh the brief you still got your briefs on. Yeah. What are you on about then? How did you interpret it? Uh, I, I think what Joe's interpreted is the early stages. Yeah, yeah, yeah. As in, you've just started. You just started. Yeah. And you just got to get withdraw. out. Yeah. yeah, That's what I meant. You are going to get a tell after tell and wing it. Come back, you tease. <laughs> 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 Oh, Max, you've made it weird. Yeah. I was right, doing something else. You're right, yeah. Jeff. Go on, go on, tell us what it was. You know, uh, gladiators, they do that. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the sound effect, yeah. though. Sticking it sounded a bit stinky. Stick it's still up the dog. This week's question is one that just, just sprung to my mind. What is something random that you crave? Ooh. Not necessarily food. I'll give you, I'll give you the thing that came to my mind. For me, it's playing Burnout Paradise. Remember that? Oh, yeah. what a yeah. game! Oh, a See, game. Have I spoke to you about this? Not really. No. I own FIFA and Burnout Paradise. Yeah, and that's the only other thing I would go on every now and then. It's just like because the the radio guy on it. Yeah, you just like, cruise. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah. cool. Yeah, that is a classic game. That is amazing. Yeah, yeah. I love that. Because we got I got a free download of my Xbox, and it was that game. I think. Nice, nice, that's a good game. What about you guys? Um, I'd say watching the last Harry Potter always lures me in. Yeah, you crave so good it. Yeah. I like craving that. Like, you know, it all kicks off. Like, yeah. Oh, like, fucking hell. Like, loads of bad guys come in and that. Yeah. That's what I crave, the big fight the battle. You know I've never seen that in the final film where, where Ron's like, oh, fucking hell. Fucking hell. <laughs> <laughs> it's mad, though, isn't it? The final film could be better, though, couldn't it? Oh, yeah, of course it could. You crave Everything it. Everything could be better. <laughs> you crave <laughs> it. <laughs> <laughs> I, crave, I crave this mediocre performance. Yeah, yeah, it was all right. Like, I can't believe the Voldemort just disappears. Yes, yeah, it's, you know it's I mean? disgusting. That bit's a bit wet. Like, he just becomes like a little flame. A little bit he just goes off in the BBC mobile. <laughs> <laughs> Quick, get out, Shabbish. <laughs> None of that bread. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I crave watching that side, but uh, and a head rub. Yeah, rubbing too hard. <laughs> Do you ever have a head rub? Yeah, but I have. Wait, wait, Roger. Sexy. It's in the uh, head of your penis. <laughs> Harry Potter couldn't have a head rub. <laughs> Anyone Stop. could split. Oh God, God, please, it? please. Blood Stop. everywhere. After years, I mean, I'm sure it's not all. So he's, yeah, he's had all those all those fights, battled off so many people, and yet, <laughs> yeah, a little a little <laughs> massage <laughs> by a head <laughs> scalp. The last scene of the film just fold him yeah. give him a head massage. <laughs> all right, yeah, instant death. Yeah, take it back, uh, Max. Do you, what do you crave? That's simple freedom of youth. <laughs> You crave the yeah. yeah, of course, yeah. yeah remember, more. remember uni and you know even further back at school. I remember uni is just mm. a haze of yeah. sex. I mean, do you do you indulge in stuff? That kind just of takes you wanking all the time. Like when you say you crave it, do you, do you broccoli soup. Oh, I don't crave broccoli soup. Not after that. Broccoli with a bit of stilton is nice. Not, not for me. me. Not, for yeah. not for. I don't ever want that again. Um, did you ever run through like a field? I guess I have done. Yeah, that was nice when you were young and free. Yeah. Bouncy Castle. Such a cliche. Yeah, oh, Bouncy Castle's a great film. Yeah. You can't yeah. Do a Bouncy Castle now. Lost you? the tooth on a Bouncy Castle. Did you? Yeah. What happened? You could hire a Bouncy Castle for the 100th episode. Yeah, we definitely could, but. Um, we could. I don't think it'd fit in the room. Oh, come to mine. Oh, no, it won't fit in Oh, another invitation, Joe, eh? Yeah, well, yeah I've poker. been invited to yours for poker. Never happened. Yeah, you've got man. A dog that you, I've got a dog that you don't like. You're all over it's the place. It's not that I don't like. It's a problem. You say these things and you just then all of a sudden gone. I, I also. Be an excuse, Joe. I don't want to cancel plans for my mum again. Just to uh, not go on a bouncy castle. And hmm. Max's mum loves poker. Not in the sexual sense, please. No, no, she loves, loves poker. Hates full house, eh? She, she loves full house. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Hates the stuff. Why, why don't you flush Love your mind, Three Joe? Three kind. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's not fitting in any orifice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> where were we? Oh, yeah. Tom, what do you crave? Uh, sometimes I just need to go and play football in my hall. Yeah. Um, yeah. So I, have the, I have an urge to run. <laughs> 
If I haven't run for a bit, I'll just... Sp- well, away from things? No, I'll just sprint. I just, like, I need to sprint. Responsibilities. So, like, you're, even if I'm, like, you're looking out, for a headline here, right? Even if I'm, like, out in town, just, like, walking, like, today, I was walking to yours, and I was what like... talking oh, about? I've, not, I've just not run in a bit, so I just ran for a bit. Be late. What are you, t- <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> no, I wasn't late. What are you talking about? Do you mean? You started running? Yeah, I like running. That'd be fucking like? mad, wouldn't it? Just run for yards. Oh, what were you, what were you wearing? <laughs> just start. Training is here. Yeah. I think you just started running. Do you not think that? Yeah, like, I mean, like, I'll, nip, I'll nip to the shop site, like, Ancoast General or somewhere, and I'll just run. Oh, sure enough, that's expensive, Ancoast General. It is I mean, expensive. It is, uh, yeah, but I don't go there for my full shop. Maybe, oh, you, go, no, maybe no. you could run away with you stolen with stuff. Food? That's how expensive it is. Thief. Yeah. Thief. No, I mean, I'll just go there because you get some Boom. nice beers and stuff, maybe a dessert, you know, whatever. It's more. Just a stretch before you start running. No. Oh. You, is it subconsciously to justify having the dessert um, beers? May, maybe. I just, you know, uh, I think I'm getting, running getting a bit. Deep. I can't, you know, can't let this happen. I don't so. think so. You like it because I'm so tense. Why, why, why would I lie? <laughs> I don't, I've why never would seen I lie? You in the street. I've passed you in the street many times and I've never seen yeah, you. Yeah, to be honest, most run. of the time when I'm in the street, I'm not running. I, I saw Tom run into uh, Morrison's a couple of weeks ago. Oh, did he? I just run to things like, if I need to, you know, granted I am late often, but <laughs> <laughs> I also get an urge to cook very complex meals. If I'm, you know, <laughs> If I'm just feeling a bit like, you know, my soul needs some sort of enrichment. Like, I, just this think, is, you know what? I exercise and I cook, guys. Yeah, <laughs> I'm, yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. kooky like that. I'm just going to make something, you know, with my evening, I'll just spend my evening cooking. I'm like, oh, I'm just, and then I just go mad for it. Sometimes I'd like to pleasure my wife. Is that such <laughs> a, am I such a bad guy? <laughs> Between running and cooking. <laughs> Can I tell you what mine is? Uh, I get the urge to push desiccated coconut into my gums. Yeah. <laughs> Weird that? Uh, just, just what, like uh, into the a bit sore. A little bit, a little yeah, bit of pain. I, I, I like gum pain. <laughs> yeah. Like I get the incidental um, brushes. I just fucking like go to town. Pain. Yeah, just push like into the into my gums. I used to, uh, I used to put Q-tips up my nose so I could sneeze. <laughs> Sneezing is fun. Though. That's fun, yeah. Yeah, sneezing is. Love a good sneeze. What? No good. She, I thought. Fun. I thought when when you were doing COVID though. tests, you hated it. Like, yeah. no, I hate yeah. that. But like, just getting that little same tick, thing? getting a little tickle. Go, like, watch. Yeah, I yeah. Think, I think it was always a wreck doing it. Right? Yeah. 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 yeah, everyone <laughs> got COVID. Well. <laughs> yeah. I'm so sick. <laughs> <laughs> Just rubbing your nose. <laughs> Test me, please. <laughs> Daddy needs to. <laughs> <laughs> what else do you crave, Max? <laughs> <laughs> Plum pudding. Spank. Do you want to crave? Spank. Do you want to yawn? You spit at the same Spank. time. Uh, what the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> what is going on? How are you? How are you engaged? Have you ever done that where you yawn but you spray spit at the same time? Uh, well, yeah. Some, uh, stop doing the face. <laughs> I can do that all the time, but can never do it. Fucking exorcist! <laughs> can you do it? No. no. You know what I mean. Uh, that's... I like, yeah. When you've open, when you open your mouth, and a little bit of spit will just flick off, like you know, like a. And you crave this. Like, that's but that's weird. Like fucking like hose. Fucking okay, hose. Yeah, they square. Yeah, I've never thought. Wow, that was good. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, fuck it. <laughs> Broken laptop humour again. Stephen lies. Stephen sweet little lies. Oh, yeah. He's proper fit and gives me a wide on. We have one truth and two lies, and they're going to come from Joe's mouth. I've done this in the past. Did you get away with it? Oh, yeah. When the I wanking one. Yeah, I, yeah, I couldn't yeah. believe that. Yeah. Um, I 100% happened. Mm. Made for a terrible wing as well. Hmm. <laughs> These are too dry. I've got something. <laughs> I, uh, I wanted to keep it all um, bottom related. Oh, well, that's oh. just you, isn't it? Because all my funny lies are bottom related, like poo myself. So here's three poo I myself stories. Can we, can we just hear the opening, opening okay. gambit? Here's one, please. I want to poo myself on Rita Queen of Speed in Alton Towers. What? I want you to poo yourself on Rita Queen, Queen of Speed in Alton okay. Towers. Not Rita, the. the <laughs> <laughs> I want to poo myself whilst trying to do a forward roll. And then I want to poo myself and I lost my passport. Yeah. Let's go for Rita first. Rita Queen How speed. old were you? We're on to you. Uh, <laughs> year 10. Tom will know it uh, well. Went to Alton <laughs> Towers. Uh, went to Alton Towers. With, um, look us. at the others as well. All right, look at you, Max. Hello, mate. Tom went to Alton Towers. Okay. When Tom we wasn't in your Tom year. Tom wasn't in my year, but in, in our school. I you go to Alton Towers. Uh, went to yeah. Alton Towers. Okay. Um, there was also Alton Towers at this point. No, you can eat Italian buffet. Do you remember it, Tom? No, I did. Wow, uh, did you remember that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. me and a guy pizza. called Ewan had an eating competition. I said, I, I think it was all you can eat. I think it was all you can eat pizza. 
it's different. Um, and uh, just put it this way, you know, sometimes Brett doesn't agree with me. We're sat on Rita, and when it does the countdown, sorry, what is Rita? Rita Queen Speed. It's, it's, a, it's a ride that goes. It would be two on towers. North to sixty, Never. real fast. Really, it North to 60, it's called Rita. Rita. You try and tell your bum yeah. that. Your career is pretty much based on eating like bread and gluten and carbs and stuff, though, isn't it? Yeah, well, not that much. Up. And then going on a roller coaster. Right, okay. Do, it goes, does a kind of do, do, do. And just unfortunately, as soon as it hits, beep, bum, bop, a bit of oh, a fart comes out. So, what did you do after this point? Um, simple. I've done this many times. Discard right. of the underpants, clean the residue, move on. Commando. Commando. So what, what time of day was it when you... 3 p.m. No, 2 p.m. Just after uh, the lunch break. So what we time sat, did you eat lunch? You know, we sit down about half 12. You know, we half don't, 12. Well, no, that's, that's, what, that's what you do in school. An hour school. and a half lunch. In school, Alton but Towers. at Alton Towers, is, oh, no, and no, you're on a trip, you can, you can go whatever time. Mm. I, went to, I went to KFC, and there's quite a lot of queues, especially when you go for school yeah. trips. So to get in there at 12.30, you probably... Oh, okay, yeah. You probably get in there <laughs> earlier. You probably get in there at 11.30. Oh, I had a bag of sweets. Should we accept this one's a lie, Joe? Ooh. You're gonna be. You're gonna be. Are we, are we, are we, are we honest? Oh yeah, because if that's you're gonna be if, you if that is true, then you've shat yourself on me to go into speed, mate. <laughs> yeah. know, it gets worse. Uh, I'm around on the school. What do you mean it gets worse? What do you mean it gets worse? Two stories are bad. Yeah, but if they're yeah. made up, it doesn't get worse, does it? No. <laughs> <laughs> for you man. so you, you pooed yourself doing a doing a what yeah forward roll the poly this was with a uh, did you say you do a, did a forward roll we, we spoke about roly polies earlier on today yeah, yeah roly poly made you shit yourself yeah ooh when he was did it, did it make you shit yourself uh, I was what I was doing a video for the Mank, uh, Pinfall Wrestling. I don't know. Oh. And you shot um, yourself. Uh, and they were practicing me to do Roly Polys. Now this one wasn't exactly a poo yourself moment, but it was a fart with a bit of a bit of you know. Did, who who was, was the wrestling group you were with? Was it Pinfall? Yeah, Pinfall. The one that Tom McManus works for, who yeah. I live with. Is it is it Pinfall? Well, because I've never yeah. said to the guys a shit of myself. I just went to the toilet straight away. Mm. I was in latex. It probably uh, it was all about shit if Tom McManus was there. <laughs> <laughs> True enough. I had a mask on. <laughs> You're one of us now. I have a mask on. Oh, we had a doctor's uniform on. Yeah. That, um, white. Uh, no. Probably would have noticed blue. the... Blue. A latex doctor's well, do- uniform. Well, doctors don't wear blue. They wear white, don't they? Yeah, but yeah, well, it was blue with like a white mask. And also, it's kind of papery, the materials. Uh, well, they would have seen the shit. Scrubs, I guess. Of course, Depends because the kind of doctor. You watch Casualty? No, not for wrestling fans. I, I'm agreeing with you. Why oh, are you coming you. for me? Thank you. So you, you did a little yourself. fart, but it was a fart with Rosie and it really stunk and I just got to change myself. <laughs> and, and, and how did they have the audio on you? <laughs> they didn't have the audio on me. I just wanted to tell you that I farted whilst doing a fart. So they didn't job. have a mic on you? Uh, no, because you rest- I was wrestling. Yeah, no mic. Was this in a, in a performance? This was to show off their next October show. So you can record it. Record it. So, so what no they want to do is train me up how to be a wrestler. Right. Right. Did a bit of two in and throwing. They try and teach me how to do a forwards roll where they sort of like flip me like that. Went to do it. <laughs> I'm imagining it and I can see how you might trump. So it is intense. Is is this that you trumped or that you pooed yourself? Well the thing is it was a, it was I think it's a it, half, was a far, it was a far but had it was a bits. very much halfway house. Yeah. A shark. You, yeah. you, you, you wouldn't want to put your head under it. Oh. <laughs> As opposed to farts that you would. <laughs> now and again. Now and again. Ah, you're yeah. So what did, what did you do? No, what did you do for the shark then? How did you clean up that one? Yeah, I just said, listen, I think I've hurt myself a bit. <laughs> I did. <laughs> I need to I, run to the bathroom. You're listen. not kidding anyone here, mate. <laughs> <laughs> Those rings do make a noise when you hit them. Yeah, they do. To be fair. Yeah. To bang like that. I said, I think I've done something here, boys. With your um, ring, yeah, with my ring. <laughs> Let me go. I checked my underpants. I thought <laughs> they'll survive another day. So it stank, and there was residue. You checked it and went back out without taking any action. In whatsoever. hindsight, I should have just changed my underpants and just got rid of them like I did Alton Towers. Yeah. Did you tell Becky these stories? Yeah. Right, She's okay. there a lot of the times when I ask, have to pull over and run into a Mackey's. <laughs> Not for food. But. So is this IBS related? Yeah. yeah. I've got what, a problem. Have you what? got IBS? I've got something. Last one, what was that? Playing five aside. Um, no, actually, was I leaving Star Wars The Force Awakens? No, I mean, uh, you already told us the last one. Your passport, Sorry, you lost You can't your... decide whether it was during a football match or leaving the cinema. But it, <laughs> was it was neither of them. Side. It was neither of them, was the, it? The last one was you farted and you, you shit yourself and you lost your passport. Yeah. Um, what, what happened, Joe? I was going on holiday the next day to... Um, uh, I think we were going to Berlin with Becky. Okay. I've done a little bit of a... Uh, I've gone playing football. I've needed a poo last minute. What um, what date was this? 
the day before. This was like a Tuesday. I don't care what day it was. What date? This was in December. It was cold. <laughs> December the what? Of which year? <clears throat> of twenty nineteen. That's going back, and it's going back. December twenty. So this is just before COVID. Yeah, just before so COVID. The world's normal. The world is normal. I'm not. The world's healthy. Get but, in my car, and I realise that. Hold on. Tom went to Germany in December of 2019. Yeah, I didn't see you there, mate. <coughs> didn't smell you either. 2018, then. Well, these are important details. I've left five aside. I've got in my car. I've realised that I don't think I'm going to make it home. I've decided to take action and go into a bush. Um, I've Sorry, no, no. The, the phrase take action cannot be yeah. applied to you've shat yourself. It definitely was, by the way. You need I to have a poo. The the, I went to the cinema. I think it was Fast and Furious. No, no, no. What is going on? The Klitschko yeah, brothers the have story. taken action in Ukraine. You shitting yourself in a lay-by is not taking action. <laughs> can I start action? again, please? Can I start again, please? It was Fast and Furious 8. Fast and Furious 8. This isn't what we're querying? I had my jeans on, that's why. So the jeans. next day after this, you're going on holiday? My jeans had my passport in. I've taken action. Good action. No, no. My issue is how you're framing this, that you're some sort of hero. I am a hero. You've seen Vin Diesel on the <laughs> cinema and gone, I'm just like, give me me shitty pants. Yeah, that's true, Jeff. I've had a, no, I yeah. went into the to- I went into the bushes. I've had a poo. I've then got home to my house in Fallowfield. <laughs> I've shut my pocket. My passport's not there. I then go back to the scene of the crime to realise my passport is right next to my poo. Oh, God. Well, right next to it. That would have been awful. Right next to your poo. If it was true. Yeah. Which I doubt it is. I don't no, believe that one. Either. I'm re- I'm should, really we ask, should we ask one more question, Drew? Yeah. One more um, question about H, please. So for the for the, the passport one, and whereabouts was it, the, the poo? Yeah, Parswood. the bush. Parswood. Whereabouts? Imagine when you drive it outside of Parswood, yeah. and then you've got the five-side pitches behind there. Yeah. There's the bushes that stop it. In them Who were you playing with? No, see, this is the thing. I thought I was playing five side, but actually, I was generally watching Fast and Furious Eight. You you don't go into that detail instantly if it's a lie. He's answering that yeah. straight yeah. away. Shame of war. I think that's true. So it's the pooey wrestling. <laughs> yeah, the, oh, that yeah. one. That one. That one isn't even a story. I I feel shouted. like that one might be true. Yeah, it's to me, it sounds true. Kind of, it's a shit one. Well, it's, it's rubbish, yeah. I think it's a glorified Le- Leaving your passport next to a lump of shit. <laughs> That's a story. It's a story, but I just I just can't buy and, that. But, yeah. but you know it's, it's... Without that, what you're telling us is, oh, I sharted during wrestling. Yeah. Which is a bit meh. Well, the thing is, like... I need an answer. That, that, um, that passport <laughs> one, that is such an incredible end to the story. It is, yeah. But there's no excuse for what a mess that was. Like you'd know that story, you'd know. You well, would know it. Told that story. Yeah. Is it no, no, it's because it's a classic tactic of telling it? the truth but telling it badly. I know. So I think the last one's true. Okay, but I'll let you two. Okay, let's go with the third one. So we'll go with the third one for that reason. That reason alone. The third one is true. Yeah. Yay! Yeah. Oh, no, back My look. problem is that I listen to the stories. <laughs> let's go back and find it, and I found it. <laughs> you trying to run off a duck? <laughs> <laughs> Couldn't believe it. I yeah. thought we was going to cancel the holiday. Passport oh. next to your poo. You're, imagine, a, you're a mess, Joe. Imagine if he gets to the airport and he pulls out poo from his pocket. <laughs> <laughs> if this is here. <laughs> so, it's funny because I thought I had five aside yesterday. I didn't. <laughs> I'm clumsy. Oh, go on, let me on, let me on. <laughs> come on. It's very stupid. Just as a fucking mascot. <laughs> a security wrestles him to the ground, he starts farting everywhere. <laughs> it's just the IBS sign that side effects, isn't it, guys? Yeah, no, mate. Yeah, no, that's, a, move. that's a funny way to uh, to end the, end the fucking segment there. Well, well done, Joe. Max, man. Whew. It's now time for uh, the viewers' most embarrassing moments. Hey. The top in that. Hey. You could be in here, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I've lived the life and not just fucking run now and again. <laughs> it makes a good point. <laughs> yeah, no, it's just shit in a bush, dude. Yeah, it's random. <laughs> yeah, the adrenaline's unbelievable. Uh, hola, gangsters and Ryan. I have a story about the time I went to Edinburgh for the Christmas markets. I would have been 19 at the time and had never been to anywhere in Scotland before, so I was very excited. <laughs> Once we'd arrived and got settled in, we went out to see the sights and made our way to the markets. 
As we approached the main bulk of crowd for the markets, I heard a barring of some sort. Naturally, I began to bar loudly in the crowd as I looked around to see where, where they were keeping the sheep. I locked eyes with a young disabled boy in a mobility chair. My heart dropped as I realised there wasn't a sheep involved at all. I hung my head in shame and began to speed walk out of the crowd, apologising precisely. I think he means profusely. That's the really embarrassing thing. Though. Uh, as I passed the boy's parents, I've never wanted the earth to open up and swallow me so much. Jesus, that's <laughs> intense. Yeah, it's now time for IMAX. Hey. Fucking hell, I hate this segment. That's right, it is IMAX. Hey guys, uh, the might of the segments. <laughs> Great on toast. Uh, wow, what a week for movies it's been. Hated by many. <laughs> Get fucked, mate. Yeah. Yeah, so eaten by a load as well. Um, wow, what a great week and for movies. Yeah. By me. <laughs> <laughs> what a great week for movies it's been, eh? Oh, a co- <laughs> Sorry, guys. Thanks for the scream of encouragement, Stephen. Uh, you think you think you hear a scream? And you think that's encouraging you. <laughs> that's not <laughs> Wow, what a great week for movies it's been. Uh, the news has been filled non-stop with movie-related uh, news, a lot of actors like and who? actresses. Will Smith from The Fresh Pins Below, that yeah. TV show. Uh, he's also in I Am Legend, Mainly which is a great movie. Ukraine. Check it out. Probably get it from your local blockbuster or something. Joe's yeah. annoying is I Am Legend was going to be the name of my film. Yeah. Your phone? Film. What happened? My phone's named Bertie. Bert, oh nice. I am Bertie. You're not Bertie. Sorry. Uh, wow, what a great week for movies it's been. Um, Will Smith, eh? Will Smith, uh, eh? Is, he? <laughs> is he better than B? <laughs> yeah. Or better than Smith? Yeah. yeah. Not me. Did you hear about the Oscars? Will Smithy. Which Will one? Smithy. Uh, the Oscars, mm. the movie-related award oh. show. Yeah. You know, the gold statues they give out for, like, best editor and stuff. Um, I was actually so back... Is that, is that you hinting you should have won? <laughs> 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 hey, if they do podcasts, please. <laughs> 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 could, you, could you edit out hey, what, 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 what a great week for movies. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it has been, actually. Has been, see yeah, the Oscars? Yeah. I'm just saving you fucking say. Did you see, mate? Did you see Will Smith at the Oscars? Yeah. It's funny, because I'm repeating myself like you do most weeks when you do your fucking segment, Tom. <laughs> anyway, uh, Oscars. I was actually backstage at the Oscars, Were you? getting some wow. in-depth raw interviews. <laughs> Prove I wasn't. Uh, you should have mentioned this at the start when I said, "What have you been up to?" No, well, I didn't want to sort of. Uh, Would it be, no, because I didn't want to. I didn't want to make you guys feel a bit jealous. Where people go, "What have these guys been didn't doing?" Didn't want you to feel yeah, jealous yeah, yeah. about what I was on doing. Edge of the seats. Nah. Yeah. <laughs> at the moment on this podcast, the, the title is. God, that's a good question, Stephen. It could have been, I interviewed Will Smith after smacking Chris Rock. I didn't smack Chris Rock. I can't wait for Adam Sandler to beat up Will Smith. Do you reckon? No, he's not really a fighter, is he? Might be. Uh, hey, guys. Um, I was backstage at the Oscars, and I got some interviews. Could you uh, play that, please, sir? Yeah, wow. What a great week for movies. <laughs> Welcome to the IMAX experience. Enjoy the show. I can't believe IMAX has been given permission to interview all these winners from tonight's Oscars. Oh boy, it's Will Smith. Have a seat, sir. I mean, what the hell is all this? Uh, It's just a small interview. I'm something of a YouTuber. Marquez Brownlee. Oh, no, no, no. I'm IMAX. Owie, that hurt. I'm stronger than I thought I was. Well, you know now, so let's move on. Owie, why? Uh, yeah, hit, hit and quit it is, is not my thing. That doesn't mean you have to keep hitting me. Uh, who's this? Yas, queen. Oh, God. It's one of my weird fans. Ooh, we'll squat on my chest and kill me, Bob. Oh, that's hot. That's hot. Bit weird, lad. You know, I used to love the movies. Now, I'm fucking jaded about. Keep my wife's name out your fucking mouth! Jaded, you fool. Jaded. Come on, you big 
ugly bear, I'll whoop you right now. I'm not fighting you, mate. Yo, put some fighter fighter music on. That's it. You've woken the beast. Owie, stop. Why? Everybody wants to be like Mike. Jordan, not Tyson, you idiot. Ugh, I'm done now. Bye. And tell Joe I said he is very ugly. Low, damn straight. Why would you do that to the greatest segment on earth? Wow. Once, once award winning. Do you what? So much potential. Yeah. Uh, Ruin it. <laughs> Nothing in there, mate. Run on empty, it seems. Yeah. Very apt. Apt. You've, you've been supping precisely <laughs> for that metaphor. <laughs> very apt. Shambles that, mate. Hey, that was good. Get out. Get out. What the fuck, Joe? <laughs> get fucked, man. I know your place on this podcast. Did you not hear the complaints? Some of them liked podcast. it. <laughs> 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 What's your mouth? He's genuinely just been kicked out. <laughs> Sorry about that. That's full of shit. We're trying to give him constructive criticism here. Uh, uh, yeah. You're getting slapped by A-listers multiple yeah. times. Multiple times. It's not a good look for you. Yeah. We're well, getting slapped. Yeah. Oh, I can yeah. take it. Joe got no, a lot of heat. I don't care if you can no. take it. It's easy, mate. I'm not worried about you breaking your jaw or something. I'm worried about... <laughs> People in Hollywood, they go, oh, there's the guy that gets spanked around by... Oh, they're all spanking each other. No, they're not. You've they're not been invited not. to the parties I have. Neither have you. It fucking have, mate. Stand <laughs> at the window. Spanking all of them. There's no... Excuse me. Hiya. Hi everyone. I'm Max's dad. What's your name? I'm Will Smith. Will I'm Smith. Say that again. How are we? Welcome. I'm, I'm I'm good, welcoming you. It's all Thank right, you. Though. How That's are we? Good. Tom... Great segments. Oh, thank you. Oh, my fucking son. Ah! Sorry. That hurt. Steve, Cheers, Daddy. Thanks for looking after him. <laughs> uh, my son, Max. He looks after me. Looks yeah, in a way. Anyway, we look after each other. Yeah, yeah. Max, you've been a good boy. Yeah, I've been good, Daddy, yeah. Yeah, yeah you've been I, eating well. <laughs> you got you got a tag in your hair. Oh, what? Oh, At least I've got hair. <laughs> Yeah, 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 that yeah, happens too. Who's that? son. Oh, that's you crazy. Yeah, job? that's insane, we man. Love each other. Did you have a fight over it? <laughs> no, no. Do you still bath like me? Uh, no, shower now. Oh, it's a shame. How does he bath like you? How would that? How would that you be? start from the gooch up. <laughs> what about the legs? Wait, you leave the legs. It's a Smith tradition. Yeah, you don't use your legs. There we go. You don't leave your legs. Yeah. Have we had a great day, everyone? We'll ask the questions, if you don't mind. Uh, yeah, Smith. what are you doing here, Daddy? To see you, son. Okay. In a while, I've brought some apple pie outside. Oh, bring nice. it in, go and bring it in. No, I actually no. do <laughs> Unfortunately, I thought I ate it. You ate oh, it? Yeah. Well, you Three should lie to your son. It's a Smith oh. tradition. <laughs> <laughs> what? I'm That's saying. bang out of order, mate. Oh. The amount of food I've given you in the past. It was a long <laughs> of walk day, you see. Yeah, instead of this guy, he runs everywhere, doesn't yeah. he? Fucking Speedy Gonzales. He runs everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> we know, isn't he? Uh, our other mate's just, uh, he just runs in his pants, yeah. Yeah, good yeah. man. Shat himself. I'm going to say it's there, good. He's just having a shit in the corridor. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's, yeah, that's Joe, still mate. Sweating. Yeah. He loves to sweat. Yeah. yeah. I don't know if he loves it. Stinky yeah. boy. Just does it. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. an issue. What's your favourite thing about him? Uh, do you know, it's his uh, warm smile. His warm smile? Why are you smiling at my friends for? What's yeah. up? Well, I know, it's just... You I'm just worried about... All this way? From yeah. Portsmouth? I d- don't Walking. even live in Portsmouth anymore. I went there for a little stop-off. <laughs> you went past... Okay. Frampton Park, yeah. Oh, yeah. Frampton. It, cramped it is, if you have a lot of fans yeah, yeah. in there. Yeah. <laughs> He's the funny one, Max. Get yeah, fucked, Dad. Shit. Cheers, Mr. Smith. Sorry, yeah, I'm worried that he's stretching my new shirt out as well. I won't worry. I will. He's got it back to front. You can see the fucking tag. Oh, so we wear them in the Smith family. No. Get yours out. <laughs> oh, what would he know, yeah? Yeah, yeah you're the trendsetter. You've forgotten what it is you're to be a Smith. I guess I have, Take yeah. that fucking t-shirt up and turn <laughs> it around, Max. Don't make me call go your mum. Don't make me call yeah, your mum. Yeah, here we go. It's the right, I, uh, it's the right thing to do. <laughs> <laughs> I've called his mum a few times. What have you called her? Nothing. Really out of order to be No, it's like friendly Come stuff, on. friendly stuff. Why don't you say it? <laughs> Fucking deck him, dad. Deck him, dad. Your kid is... He's called mummy sexy. sexy. He's what? 
Come, come, you said she was sexy. Didn't you? Yeah. What are you sniffing your fingers for, you weirdo? Oh, 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 <laughs> oh, 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 I'm the place a bit in where I'm speaking from, but I'm back. <laughs> are you? What have you said? I haven't said anything. I just said, <laughs> what have you said? I just said, said gold. Sexy. Oh, sexy. Sexy, sexy, uh, what's her name? <sighs> yes, Will Smith. The love of my life. Maxine. 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 <laughs> yeah, sorry, that. Maxine, Maxine Smith. Maxine. Yeah. Colour love lips in the bedroom. Oh, love wh- lips. Which lips? You're <laughs> uh, uh, nice. <laughs> you better not be. You fall through. That's <laughs> <laughs> Bang out of order, that here, Daddy. One more, I've had enough. One more, I swear. What are you going to do? Oh. So, so that your wife went out there. Fuck it, no! <laughs> Keep my wife's name out of your mouth. <laughs> Keep your wife. Lovely to see you. Yeah, you too, Keep my wife's name out your fucking mouth. <laughs> Dirty bastards. That's the Smith. Joe, put your pants up. <laughs> Get away from my apple pie. <laughs> wow. Wow. That's insane. I can't say I was, I was shocked at his, his outrageous outburst. I thought it would come sooner, actually. <laughs> <laughs> You're right, mate. Right, so oh, you usually just piss on the floor. Isn't it? <laughs> thanks for that. Hi, Max. Max. Cheers. Uh, thanks for uh, listening to it, I guess. Bold of you to assume. Yeah. Sounds like for Joe's woes. It's Joe's woes. <laughs> Joe's woes. Joe's woes. Joe's woes. Joe's woes. Joe's woes. I wish that Velcro was more commonly uh, like used on no. shoes. No. On, on adult shoes. Yeah, on adult shoes. Hey, that's the sound. mine. Sometimes when you lace it up, you think, can you be bothered? Well, well, Max doesn't like the sound he's just said. <clears throat> What's your argument to that? Sounds off a, the wrong it's message. Well, it's it? it's a wrong message. It's a bit nonsense, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. We need to stop it from being. If old. it was an old man, I wouldn't. I wouldn't. Well, maybe not an old man. Maybe not an old man. A middle-aged man. A middle-aged man. Yeah, he's he's very, very able. If I if I see a thirty-seven-year-old <laughs> man in a playground with Velcro shoes on, yeah, I think I'm worried. Yeah, yeah. because you, why are you, you why are you looking in, in the playground? playground? <laughs> <laughs> I'm worried. What's he doing on my turf? <laughs> <laughs> hey kids, look out for that man. He's got yeah. Velcro. <laughs> Uh, I'm also upset that cherries I've seen. Well, we haven't dealt with your first problem. <laughs> <laughs> All we've done is call you a paedophile. Yeah. No, Velcro's paedophile I get it. And we you want it. Ch- you no, want it we more widely accepted. It. We need to change it. Yeah. Then we accept paedophiles. Oh. That Velcro gets worn. Would you- I mean, my Velcro has gone on my shin pads now. Good shin pads, but like, they kind of doesn't yeah, work anymore. Would you accept Velcro coming back into fashion if it also brought along paedophiles? No, 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 no. I've drawn right. the line Everything, you know, comes at a cost, though. Can I see yeah. that drawing? At some point, you know... Right, then, do you know what, actually? How, how much paedophilia you is too much paedophilia? You've changed my mind. I don't bring want Velcro, Velcro anywhere near it. Velcro's done in my eyes now. Okay. okay. You've no. changed me. Right. Well done. What's next? Therapy, Seeds then. and cherries. Don't Why they have to be there? Seeds They've and cherries. They've sorted out with grapes. They got rid of the grapes and the seeds. Yeah. Why can't they do it with cherries? So you just pop them in. Good point. It's not a seed, it's a stone, isn't it? Can't get rid of stones, man. Yeah. Why? What, can you Am I a scientist? Are you a scientist? Noom no. can. But we, yeah, we can't. It's pretty educated kind of yeah. place that we're coming from. That's so true. I agree with it, though. You know, there's, uh, yeah. I've swallowed too many cherry stones. What happens if you swallow a cherry stone? They grow inside you. That's it. You become really funny. <laughs> Hey! Nom, 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 nom. Oh, really? What was that? <laughs> nom, nom, nom. What are you eating there? Eh? Cherry stones. Oh, I thought you had Velcro. <laughs> yeah, any other fruits that... Why do paper cuts hurt really? Well, no, no, he's talking about, he's talking about oh, fruits. Yeah, You've got to listen like, to what he's saying. Ne- ne- nectarines, plums, yeah. peaches, they avocado, want, stones. The avocado stone is so so yeah. profound and big, isn't it? Yeah. Bigger than the avocado sometimes. Where they all go? <laughs> you That's you not avocado they you're eating. <laughs> <laughs> eat a lot of avocado, don't we, in this country? I don't. Really too go. much. I don't eat avocado. Don't like it. Do you not? No, love avocado. Stand it. No, I don't like Do you it. like yeah. avocado? I don't love it. Oh. But I like it. Taste and texture. It's all right. Like, kind of, I can do stuff with it. It's a good ingredient. Did you know in the sewers that it's they're filled with tomato plants because the poo? Wow. And smart seeds in your you poo. When you go through what the sewers, it's a utopia. Just down literally, there, really is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's it's beautiful. beautiful. We go, we go sewer diving. Yeah. Alan Titch two times a week. Down it's there. just a little slice of heaven, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Plum or cherry tomatoes? <laughs> what? For tomatoes, mate. Any tomato you can I like, think I'll of. Go I like cherry. Piccolo tomatoes. Nice cherry, isn't it? Yeah. 
Um, Ketchup. Last George Wells <laughs> is why the paper cuts hurt so much. <laughs> really I think thin. It's the shock. Sometimes the shock of something Ooh. happening is a lot mm. worse. It feels like the pain you've never had before. I think apparently it's because under a microscope, it's the <laughs> most. It's really jagged. Oh, so like it seems to be a slice, but a knife will give you a much finer slice, whereas paper cut, it's it's actually not very strong. So it's because it's so jagged, why it cuts. You know, uh, so it's like stings, stinging nettles. It, that's sort of like a Velcro. It's loads of tiny little things just clawing at you. Yeah. It's got poison in, but also because there's so many, like, millions of these little things ripping holes in you. That's why they sting so much. Did Doc Leafs actually help? A little bit. They? they sort of counteract the poison. How so? I don't fucking, I'm not a scientist, am I? Seems a bit sciencey. Jesus. Seems to know a lot about the nettles, but yeah. not about the that's cure. Joe's woes. I only have three, but four. It's good, no? It's, it's good, yeah. It's good. good. Pedophilia, bring that back. Oh, no. no. <laughs> Paper bring cuts. Back Peter Bowles in Velcro. <laughs> take no, out, I just want take to take out cherry stones. Shoes stones. a bit taken to be serious. Make it easier for them to eat fruit. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, Joe. Thank you. It's now time for Tom Looney. 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 loves it. Looney. 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 So if you remember last week, I did uh, um, X that women. Are you going to do it about, about reverse uh, it? Yeah, and I said, it was, I said that last week. Sure, people will be watching just for this. <laughs> when she blames her horrid behaviour on astrology. Yeah, uh, oh, yeah. God, oh, he's, he's yeah. such a scorpion. Yeah. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> yeah, man. I'm, a I'm a Capricorn. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a Capricorn. Why do you have to rub that in my fucking <laughs> oh, face? Use that as an example. <laughs> Jesus Christ. No, I don't know enough about star signs to know. I know mine. I didn't know what, What's I know yours? what the dates are. Scorpio, I know mine. Ooh. Yeah. That's a little scorpion. Actually, that's sexy, yeah. that one. My, my nephew's a. Uh, uh, yeah. Tom, you, you and your Velcro shoes. <laughs> <laughs> my nephew's a scorpion. Yeah. Well, Difficult, mate. Yeah, man. He's, he's a he's a mess. Sorry, I'm just, I'm just and he's, he's got shit segments as I'm well, doesn't he? Make this work. Yeah, Fuck it up. <laughs> well, Tom, sorry, what's the uh, Not wearing appropriate uh, weather appropriate clothing and then bitching about how uncomfortable it is. Yeah, man. So yeah. true. Yeah. Women, no, can't they? Yeah. God. My yeah. mum dresses appropriately all weathers. Yeah. 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 Uh, if not, she just strips off. Uh, yeah. When women are obsessed with things like Disney, it makes me feel like I'm dating a nine year old. Um, what what, what do you think of that? Yes. My ex was three years old than me, uh, and she was super cringy obsessed with Harry Potter. <laughs> like I'm off a hug. The last one, shit, but uh, thirty years old. Hey, what about uh, the last one? Oh. Yeah, do you know what? No, it's uh, I, I do. You can't uh, call your fiance your ex girlfriend. I, I do. You said this at uh, Tom Lewis about pencils. I do. What? No, there's a little pencil surprise at the end. Oh, oh uh, well, they're dreadful. Do we win a pencil? No, no. Let's no, no, see where this fucking better. pencil goes, better. eh? Yeah. <laughs> uh, um, <laughs> so I feel. <laughs> we're, we're, women who declare they're a queen that deserve a king. Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah I, I, I used to say that I was a king that deserved a queen. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It works both ways, I guess. Uh, um, yes. <laughs> I want my princess Diana, I used to show. Yeah. <laughs> the tunnel in France. Uh, g- I was there the other day. Yeah. yeah. So, so, I, I was there. At the tunnel. G- girls that do that whole dizzy, uh, dizzy dumbass routine, <laughs> pretending to be dumber than they are. Even a car. Uh, while, putting yeah, on a, yeah. while putting on a fake squeaky yeah. voice, acting dumb in front of guys. Can we skip to the pencil surprise? No, don't. We didn't skip through Joe's woes. We yeah. did in the edit. I did, <laughs> uh, I did three. Uh, Joe's woes? Who's what you As, talking asking about? me what I want to do, Ori, when in reality, they're expecting me to guess what they want. Yeah. I don't know that. Yeah, no, when I that. ask, I, no, I generally want an that answer. One. I do get that one. Yeah. Um, <laughs> got some, uh, <laughs> got some of them uh, weather, weather's original. Two oh, of the things yes. we also hated. Creamy toffees there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that we talk about. Hands off. You have to win them. Ah, what ah. do you mean win them? So obviously there was no clear winner from this week's segment, so uh, we'll have to look. I just <laughs> <laughs> Wait, there, was a, the <laughs> there was a quiz. Yeah, yeah, there was a quiz. Yeah, there was a quiz. There were winners. There was no losers. queer winner. No, obviously there was no quiz, but I got these. You said there's no queer winner. I was going to do no something. There's no queer women. I was going to do something quiz based, and I thought, oh, well, I've got these now. I thought, well, someone, you know, I want to give them out on the podcast. I want to bring the creamy toffees in. So at the end of the segment. <laughs> creamy I'll, toffees. I'll do a little question. <laughs> this guy runs around carrying creamy toffees. <laughs> He's a pedophile. <laughs> someone, someone stop. Stop him. <laughs> oh, God. So, we're talking about your dodgy <laughs> shin pads earlier. Sugar free. <laughs> Kids can kick it. <laughs> it's gone off. It's gone off. Uh, I'm looking for the closest. In miles, how long? <laughs> What's in miles, poor bloke? <laughs> <laughs> How fun. How long is the line that you can draw with a standard 
HB pencil before it runs out. Hey, that what about the line you draw in in society? Ever yes. Read. Yeah. How long is the line that you can draw with a standard HB pencil before it runs out? Well, it's not before it runs out. What are you doing it on? Are you graffiti? Oh, of course. Are you a fence? Would the police stop you halfway through? Are you doing through? it on a fence? Paper. We'll say it's on paper. Is it just yeah. a piece of paper? Well, Sometimes a massive fucking piece of paper. Obviously, it's not practical for a piece of paper that long. But if you were to carry it on. How far would you get? Can I just say, out? if I if my answer isn't correct, I'd like to be proved wrong. Two mi- doing three it. miles, three miles. Uh, I'm still talking in terms of uh, you know what you're actually going to do on concrete. Yeah, no laminate. Okay. That's going to be a I mean, mess. I mean, I who's who's cleaning reason? this? What metric are we basing this on? Is it feet, miles? It is. It is such an inconvenience. Yeah. No one's ever done this shot. Joe, no, you're moving the mind. You can do the calculation based on how long it is, how far a small line is. Yeah, but what fucking eroded. nerd has wasted their time working What's this out? Tom? You have to do it on such a weight that you, when you need to sharpen it. Yeah, yeah. real sharp. Oh, this, but no, you can't this sharpen is. Here's the issue. You can't sharpen it because as you sharpen it, you lose the lead be, yeah. or the this graphite. Is, I don't believe this could so be this done. Is, no. I mean, this is, I mean, I'm on penciledirect.com in the UK. <laughs> And they've oh, got... So it's homepage. Do you want me to get Google? <laughs> <laughs> and it seems a bit... Uh, Imagine got, doing a segment without the internet, mate. Mm. <laughs> Don't we? Getting other people to do your dirty work. Well, this, this seems to be... I'm out there in this Hollywood. This is commonly kind of sourced. Like, obviously, I need what to... What do you mean commonly sourced? I'm on, I'm on the... Fo- Fuck me. It's, it's 200,000 miles. 200,000 miles. Fuck off. Three miles. Um, I'll go between that with five miles. Okay, Stephen, you've won the creamy top. Yeah! What the fuck, man? It's the highest number. Who can think of the highest number? And I won. You are a dunce. You know that. <laughs> I'm the dunce. 35 miles what? before it runs out. That's what I say. 35 so miles. I'm, I'm going to do. I'm going to do the London Marathon with it. With 35 a, miles. Put your hand away. Yeah. Can I have a creamy top here? No, you lost. Max was second in my book. <laughs> yeah, I was. No, I was. You, you underestimated. Yeah, I two kilometres a ballpoint pen so in comparison so that's fucking mega wow close is that yeah but that wasn't the question enjoy your creamy sophistry thank you thank you Tom yeah. Jesus Christ I don't even like them creamy sh- toffees I can't have them yeah. oh right Why? creamy toffees hey, I can I can you have will. two Let's can I have one please why did you well, get the non sugar ones because he's fucking oh yeah they're nice aren't they they're yeah, creamy and toffee yeah. I'm just going to pretend I've got one yeah, you're the real one here, Joe. We can't afford to lose Tom Looney when he gives us treats. Yeah. I gave you audio-based treats. No, you didn't. Yeah, you remember no, for you the confused, rest of your life. You're confusing treats. <laughs> I think we should, have, we should have a movie review. Yeah. Right Not now? right now, no. There you go. Stop trying to do one. Wow, what a great week for movies. <laughs> Max, are you willing to do movie reviews? 100%. Handwritten. With this very pencil? No, 35 miles long. (laughs) (laughs) You want to take a picture? From the moon. Not from the moon, silly (laughs) boots. Can't do that, mate. (laughs) I don't know, I I can't. A lot of of can'ts and won'ts here. (laughs) (laughs) He's going to get me to clean the room up later. (laughs) (laughs) Please let the podcast know. I set this room up myself. (laughs) Please (laughs) work. It's going to make me pick up that one. <laughs> no! <laughs> the union will hear about this. It's not a union. <laughs> not a union. Wouldn't, wouldn't, wouldn't allow to be one. No, I, yeah. I refuse the no. union. Uh, it's now time for our penultimate segment. <laughs> Put it to the max. Put it to the max. To the max. Put it to the max. Hey, hey. hey Joe, now we've, got, creamy, creamy. now we've got all this stuff. We can do that, uh, that camping one. Oh yeah, oh, that's gonna be fun. So uh, we'll let you know how that goes. Fuck <laughs> off! <laughs> <laughs> Who's this passport? In the- oh my god! Smell <laughs> 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 the creamy toffee peppers. <laughs> Sugar-free will do that to you. Yeah, yeah. Need your help, yeah. lads. Nope. My brother, fucking maniac that he is, keeps busting my balls. What? <laughs> Making his balls bust. I'm getting heavy with a lady. He Chromecast pity laughs on me TV. Kills the mood. And she never speaks to me again. Last week, he ate my poetry homework. Laughing and saying, no one will ever believe you. They didn't, and I got detention. <laughs> what the fuck do I do? How do I stop this chump pranking me, kiss? I think so, somebody I think somebody thought <laughs> uh, James Ormrod would be on the uh, podcast this <laughs> week. 
<laughs> you should have put wing it. Castle <laughs> So do it again. <laughs> I read it and I was like, what's pity laughs? So they've been Chromecasting pity laughs, which would kill the mood. Yeah, yeah, oh, would definitely, yeah. It turns you on. Yeah. I don't think. Is there anything less sexual than James Homer? <laughs> oh, it's tricky. Yeah. But you, Are we answering that question now? Yeah. yeah. Probably. Well, that's yeah, a whole probably. podcast in itself. Yeah. It's supposed to be list everything. you become a sexy guy, though, isn't he? Yeah, I think you emerged yeah. from the bush. You know, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you should have covered forex. It's probably it sexy. Like fucking James Homer. It wasn't like... A bit like Daniel Craig-esque. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that fucking... <laughs> Oh, just shit oh, smeared yeah, down one. his legs. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> What's that film? Rambo. 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 Yes. Yeah, my own poo. Yeah. First okay. shit. Rimbo. Uh, uh, nothing. Yeah. Rimbo would be good. Sham. Yeah, I'd watch that. I'd watch yeah. Rimbo. Yeah, Rimbo was a thing. Max is going to review Rimbo for the hundredth <laughs> episode special. <laughs> oh, it's the special, isn't it? It's the special. Well, we've had we've had Bugs Life, School of Rock. Let's yeah. do Rimbo. I'll no, find it. No, it's not a wee, is it? Yeah, this uh, is Max's segment. I think the last time he just give you woes. I give unless you it's, nothing. Unless but it's a reaction to uh, IMAX. No, oh, nothing but joy, baby. Yeah, like a woe, yeah. like what? a woe. What can I do for a special for the hundred? Just go through everything you've ever said and no, just. No, re- I, I don't want to be the best bits Take that a fact I've already done. Every 99 episode you've done. I oh, know you wouldn't have done all 99, would you? Uh, that's just me going back over them. Any ideas now? I, I, I like to bring something that's engaging that people want, you know. Do you? Engage yeah. it, engaging. Hey. Great callback. Hey. Great callback. Hey. That's why he's on the podcast. Yes. She said yes. Did, did she? Though? Did she though? Mm. Or did you, was she silent and you've assumed it? She said yes. Did you say under your breath? She's wearing the ring. <laughs> did you say uh, yes when the ring dropped and got lost? What are you looking for, AJ? What you about can't... what about what about sentries? Why don't we do some? Do you know what? Don't worry about it. It's fine. I'll... Why don't we do some about the the I'm sorry, I asked. like I'm sorry, sentries I asked. in cricket? <laughs> good, good idea. Yeah, you, know, you name batsmen that have hit yeah. a century. I'll list some batsmen that have hit centuries in cricket, and you guys can just react to that. Could get a pot of honey because people say one honey. Nice. Yeah. That's Singing outside the box. Yeah, and we could see how much honey. But yeah. inside the beehive. It's so <laughs> sticky. Yeah. It's so sticky. We'll give everyone yeah. a jar of honey. What, you're in one minute to see if you can eat the most. <laughs> yeah. Yes, I'd, I'd, I'd would, watch that. I would go with. You still think the, the the list in batsmen might be better? <laughs> no, no, no. I think I think in terms of who'd eat the most honey, yeah. I think it'd be Joe. Yeah, yeah. definitely. No, they say someone if you eat loads of honey, like your eyes go a bit funny. <laughs> Is that just a rhyme? And <laughs> yeah. That's why you believe. Oh. Is that what your mum said to get you out of the No, bathroom? she's running. <laughs> <laughs> My pants are coming. <laughs> like I mean, great man, the original influencer. Yeah, I'm yeah. just gonna just gonna pop that mic down. <laughs> when, uh, as Winnie the Pimp on yeah. uh, Halloween. Did you? Did you? Yeah. yeah. Wasn't it Win It the Pimp? <laughs> <laughs> Didn't take a lot of dressing up. <laughs> and it's crusty nose. I'm here, baby. <laughs> I went to see you I'm just leaving a field in Manchester. He's <laughs> 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 uh, That's what he says. Isn't it? Yeah, you're the donkey. God, you're good at your impressions, Joe. Thank you. Would you do Tigger? Do you know what? No, don't. Oh, okay. Don't do it. I'll save it for the 100 I'll save it. I'll save everyone. I'll save you. What a tease. That's what he says. What a tease! I don't think he does say that. <laughs> that Christopher that, Robin, what that, a tease! That sexual tension in there. Uh... <laughs> Joe just teasing. Hey, piglet! More like friglet. <laughs> what a tease! <laughs> yeah. Bounce on this motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, wait, oh yeah. So uh, turn pity laughs off. Yeah. And I never watch it again. And I mean, your brother's eating your homework. You yeah, which just a strange thing to do. Laminate it. Yeah, oh, that's so good. Just walk in yeah. the bedroom. Poison it. Poison the sink. Think, I don't think it's issues. <laughs> yeah. Put anthrax. Yeah. 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 Fuse. Yeah. So kind of mix the ink with anthrax, and then one, it won't eat your homework again. Yeah. You won't be alive to a Chromecast. That that's the easy thing to do. Sexy things. Yeah. Your sexy time. More difficult is to type up your work and email it to your teacher. Yeah. That is tough. So it's tricky. It's hard. yeah. I mean, it's twenty twenty two. You know, could you could be maybe use a computer. Yeah, you know, I mean, I don't want to put, yeah. shame someone who's can't afford a computer. I'm sorry, but maybe they're Chrome, Chromecasting. But yeah, that's what I mean. To be it's fair, he's money he, in the family. He also emailed the uh, yeah. question in yeah. from the library. Oh yeah, sure. Uh, Where you could do your homework. Yes, uh, and have sex. Or wank. Have or you wank. ever had a wank in the library? No. Where place you've had a wank? 
Oh dear. <laughs> oh god. Save no. Fitty's beach, wasn't okay, it? You were on the podcast. Save it for the podcast. Yeah, and yeah, also, so on... Tom, Tom makes a great <laughs> point. You're on the podcast. <laughs> Save yeah, me. Joe, what, what, what do you think this is? Yeah, yeah. And your stock is plummeting well, right no, now. It's only like a jacuzzi. So, do you mean probably a jacuzzi? So you've done it in a jacuzzi. But not like at a spa. No, not in a spa. Was it a friend at a friend's house? A pool, Centre park, jacuzzi park. Yeah, like a little. Yeah, yeah I think it was. Well, like a gym. Garden. Someone's like lazy. Gym. Someone's lazy spa. Easy. Yeah. Spa, yeah. You're you're saying like a garden. Like you're questioning me, Max or Tom. You know it's in a garden. You would have wanked in somebody like else's jacuzzi. Yeah, Whose was, was it? When you're that age, you think. What age? Oh. What age? Thirty-seven. Oh, Fuck me. Oh, you're definitely you're definitely twenty-three. Whose jacuzzi was it? Can't say. Say. No, no, no. 100, say. Did they did they get pregnant say. about you know? No, eight, I was alone in there. The I was alone in the jacuzzi. Yeah, but the where, sperm where lives. Everyone else, else? Everyone else was getting away. off with each other, and you were just in the jacuzzi, just watching it. Where was everyone else, Joe? I think we were in Wales. Well, was, oh, it was a family home. So where was everyone? They were all inside. And if, is it a friend's house? So you kind of gone to like an Airbnb I, or something? I don't is it a holiday? No, he's 15. Was it a holiday? Was family family holiday. Friend? Family holiday, both, isn't it? Both in attendance. Okay. Family, family and friends. friends. Was it your family or a friend's family? My f- f- family. Your friends. family and friends had come along. Listen, you should do it every, every, you know, it used to be like a family, family tradition. Well, you know, when you're at your peak. <laughs> so so you right? you spend the day surrounded by your family and you oh. think, I'm going to have a wank. <laughs> In a jacuzzi, which yeah. they're going to get into at a later date. Oh, Joe! And it's not just yeah. people don't clean their jacuzzis that often. Well, he yeah. wasn't. Yeah, we've but seen you would, your car. But you would have, you know, if you're you're getting sat in a jacuzzi that night, <coughs> you normally kind of do put your chemicals well, in and do everything the one. night before. And then, sorry, uh, Come on. and then where's the worst place you've had a wank? I don't know. I don't have a sit like that. Uh, to be fair, mate, I've, I've heard the stories. <laughs> mine was yeah. mine was in a garden. Uh, in Wales, <laughs> I could just see this lad just rubbing one hand. <laughs> it gets me going. I, I got flustered. Yeah, <laughs> and he could definitely see he, me. He, could, no, he couldn't see me. He was, he was looking at the dog next door. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but I'm not going to say anymore because you're not. So you're not okay. Fine. We should have gone that about two hours ago. <laughs> yeah, Doesn't I was outside. Uh, I just can't think where. China. Weirdest. Yeah, China. I don't want China. I don't think I've had. I've not been made. to China. I don't mean trying to sick off all the continents. Wanking all the comments. What's his name? Wanking all the comments, Dan. Dan? That's now you're getting on, Dan. Uh, uh, interesting to hear from you. Africa. Sounds like a really good piece. Who's in Egypt? Oh. Asia. Yeah. If you had a wank at one of the seven wonders of the world, where would it be? Taj Mahal, pyramids. If you were to masturbate onto one of the seven wonders of the world, wow, which one would you masturbate one. onto? This great, is a great question. wall of China. Yeah. Probably the least offensive one. Yeah, Niagara Falls one, and it's the longest. So you know, uh, <laughs> no, I don't think Niagara Falls is. That's one of the natural world, isn't it? Natural, natural world. Is, yeah. Are you going to jump in afterwards? Yeah. <laughs> it's going to be very clear what you're doing. Yeah. Catching the way down, surrounded by your family. Yeah. <laughs> oh God, I've Joe, beat my own. Joe, what are you doing? <laughs> 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 uh, would you beat your own sperm no well it depends on the the situation if somebody's got a gun is the eighth wonder bearing <laughs> somebody's got a gun to my head same time as sperm would you beat it no yeah. I think you would you're rapid yeah if I fell at the same time if you fell at the Niagara Falls at the same time as your sperm would you beat it oh I thought you said would you eat it no right uh, yeah you would yeah uh, uh, it's time for the final question it's the Question. Uh, what's the largest mammal you think you could knock out with a single punch? Largest. Yeah. Mammal. Mammal. Is it goat or mammal? Yeah. No, you're not punching me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. So some of these like have like hardened skulls. Like yeah. goats, like a goat has got horns, hasn't it? It's not easy to... No uh, horny heads. Heads are protected. In a way. Yeah. Like a dolphin. Yeah, right on the chin. Right on the chin. Oh, Bang. Yeah. Good night. <laughs> To be um, fair, no, that's, I think... Dolphin? So we have really what we, need, what we need to do is now, we need to go into why Joe is having to punch the dolphin. Mm. What's going on? <laughs> did the, the, did the dolphin defend itself? <laughs> got lost in the jacuzzi. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, didn't like what he saw. Blow all in it. <laughs> <laughs> Blow this. No, the question was... <laughs> the question was... <laughs> the kids on the make-a-wish. What, what <laughs> Joe, Joe's shagging yeah. the dolphin. <laughs> Go away, this one's mine. <laughs> you said what mammal? Could I've got wishes too. <laughs> 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 I'm, I'm dying. <laughs> I'm dying of blue balls. <laughs> Not really. I had a wank in the pool about three minutes ago. <laughs> <laughs> Round two. <laughs> no, the question was why are 
why are we know what the question no, was, Joe. It's like a sexy you, talk. Just... Why are you meeting a dolphin? That wasn't the question. <laughs> meeting? The question was, could you knock a dolphin hey, out? Hey, man. Why have you arranged this meet? <laughs> so I can knock what are you out. doing here? <laughs> so you can knock... What, is that what you said Joseph to the dolphin? Joseph's special tonight, Joseph. Myself. <laughs> <laughs> was it bare knuckle? Oh, uh, yeah. 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 Okay, so I can knock out a person. Could you? Probably. Could you? I mean, maybe a people baby. are built differently, but like, you know, someone's <laughs> yeah, a proper, Tom, Tom proper meathead, I might struggle to knock out, but you know, someone's <laughs> a bit more slight in their build. Who's a meathead? If they were, if they were stood just looking at you, <laughs> yeah. if they were aware of it. Well, I guess I know the point to go for on a human because I'd go for the temple, wouldn't I? Yeah, yeah, yeah hope It's very hard to get. Back. Sorry? Are they not fighting back at all? Yeah, it's this Joking. thing strapped down and you just get one free it's shot. One punch. Okay, now, look, look, element of surprise. You walk up to this mammal and you punch it in. Punch well, it if it's a sea mammal, can you walk up to one I, of them? I, I, if I punch a penguin, I'm not knocking it out. Yeah, it's, probably, it's probably going to You gonna are, you can fucking kill it. Fucking knock a penguin out. No, it's going to get up about 10 seconds no. later. Like, back no. Yourself, back yourself. <laughs> that was good. <laughs> back yourself. You'd knock a penguin out. Yeah, I'm going to back myself. I can, what is this? Back, back yourself, back yourself. It's not an away day. <laughs> back yourself. <laughs> fucking Antarctic away. So I can knock a So I took action. Out. <laughs> I'd, I'd knock a make out. Easy. One yeah. Well, yeah, they're quite small. But penguins are penguins are a lot I mean, harder. I don't think you think, uh, the you largest think mammal. Like I'll tell you what the largest one I could probably knock out a giraffe. If I climbed a tree, you're not knocking out a giraffe. <laughs> you're off your head. Head. Because they've got tiny little heads. They've got tiny, tiny little heads. No, they've quite, not. They're not. They look you tiny crush it. So far away. Yeah, have you seen how they fight? They use their head on. Like, yeah, the but this is one. Weapon. This is one, one free hit, isn't it? But I feel like I feel like. I mean, look, you're asking me to get the biggest. Obviously, yeah, maybe it's a bit out there, but I'm not going to go straight in with meerkat and underestimate myself. I don't think we. I don't think you could knock out. Penguin, yeah. and penguins. Are I guarantee I can knock up. out the tallest man because they're quite. They've got weak hearts. They're really. <laughs> they're frail. Are you not, one hit to the head. Thor, down. Thor is seven foot, isn't he? Yeah, but yeah, have you not seen the tall, out. like the Guinness World Record tallest men in the you world? Can't reach him. Yeah, get a fucking. I'll kick his in the shins. He'll go. Oh, and I go wham like yeah, that like right in the head. One punch. Yeah, that's you like got a one kick. punch. You can't even reach the tallest. I'll be man. all right. Could you just come a here for a minute? Maybe a sloth. No, because a person's bigger than a sloth. That's tight. Yeah. You can knock a person out. I think you can knock, I think, a, I you can knock you... a sloth out because they're already quite sleepy. Yeah. So they're just going to go. The giraffe, I'll get the giraffe when it's asleep. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I wake up and then go. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. What about a gorilla? Because because <laughs> the thing is, they're quite close to humans, right? So, they, you know, anatomy wise, and, you know, go aim for the temple. I mean, knock you'd them hope out. so. You'd hope so. There's no way you're knocking a gorilla out. Yeah, no, it's unlikely, Joe. I agree with you. <laughs> Do you know when you, you punch this gorilla yeah. and it doesn't get knocked out? Yeah. What do you then do? Oh, Stephen, I fucked it. <laughs> which is, which is what, a sloth. I'm aiming big. I'm going for the silverback gorilla. Granted, I'd probably fail. Like, okay, there's a fallout. I'm just going to forego this altogether. I'm not getting into a fight. I think, yeah, because you've got to guarantee that you knock it out because okay, otherwise guarantee the animal's there. Out. Yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ. Human got, child. <laughs> what? <laughs> and knocking a human child out. Yeah, that's my man. Then you've got to have that on your conscience. It's all right. <laughs> maybe maybe if it was a little kid going... Knock a penguin out. Yeah. Okay, baby, not, I don't baby th- giraffe. I said I couldn't knock it out. Baby yes, giraffe. Baby giraffe. Freshly born. Yeah. Baby giraffe. Freshly baby born. born. Yeah, you're asking... Oh, a donkey. Yes, freshly yeah. born. Donkey. A little horse. Horses, I can knock a horse. Yeah. Yeah. A horse after yeah. it's done horse a big race. You, you know, yeah. you, you make yourself like fools. <laughs> yeah, no, donkey. That's going to look like you lost a bet. It's not a donkey. <laughs> yeah. Is this going to be one of the punishments? Uh, no. Not Beating not up a horse. Yeah. yeah. It's kind of sad, isn't it? Because I don't want to. Like, I'm kind of a horse. I'm worried. I think that's as what a vegan, at, you know. Yeah, I mean, I'm, as I'm, a vegan, obviously you're worried about animals that aren't going to fight back. But then it seems even worse to go for something that's not going to fight back, and it's just going to be like so sad. I, I don't. I need to think of an animal that I dislike. I guess it has to be man, then. Wow! What a way to, to fucking sort of hell! Sort of like Hitler or something. Yeah. No, oh, that would be. Ooh. No, mate. Uh, I'm not going to go with penguins because I like them. Maybe like a really sickly old man. Baby giraffe. <laughs> you saw your baby giraffe. I, I guess I'll go for gorilla. Excessive consumption may produce laxative side effects. Oh. Uh, thank you for watching the <laughs> Stephen Trice podcast. I've been joined by Joe McGrath. <laughs> I'm in a job. Get out, get out, Joe. Get, get out. Six. <laughs> Tom, Tom Looney. Hey. Looney. 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 Cheers, thanks for watching. And Max Smith. Cheers, guys. Thanks Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. Uh, Don't listen to Tom fighting away. I'll ship myself. Stay safe, stay humble, and ciao.